Alright, welcome to another one of my how-to's. This is going to be a quick uh, two-step how-to on DVD backup. Um, the program that I use is DVD Fab. Um, it has a free trial, but you can also uh, buy it if you'd like. Uh, just the website's dvdfab.com. Um, first, we'll start DVD Fab. We're going to use Fast and the Furious as a sample. Um, just load the DVD in, and it'll analyze it. And then on DVD Fab over here, you'll have uh, options to uh, full disk, main movie, split, customize, clone, merge, and write data. Um, full disk, of course, is the full disk. Main movie is just a movie with no menus or anything like that. Split is where you can uh, split a DVD 9 movie into two DVD 5s. Customize is where you can uh, uh, include the different audios of whatnot or you want, or you can include some special features or none, or the menus or whatnot. Uh, just kind of make your own little output of what, of what you'd like. Clone is an exact uh, replica. Merge is where you can take uh, different DVD files and put them on one disk. And write data is where you can uh, write uh, DVD VOB file folders to a DVD. We'll go ahead and just go with the main movie on this. Uh, we'll go over here and just choose the English as the main audio track, and we won't use any subtitles. Uh, and then we'll just click uh, as the output onto the desktop, and we'll just hit start. <clears throat> Depending on how long the movie is, it's how long it'll take. Um, hour and a half movies usually take about 10 minutes, so about 10 minutes, and I'll be right back. Alright, so we're back. It's been about 10 minutes, and the outputted main movie is right here on the desktop. All we do from there is go to Write Data, choose the folder, which is right here, and choose your destination drive. And then all you do is just click Start, and it'll start the burning process. And when it's finished, you'll have a brand new DVD backup. And that's about it. Stay tuned, and I'll uh, be making some more how-tos. Alright, thanks a lot.